What's up, y'all? What's goody? Let's see what we got going on here. What's the masculine feeling right now? Unleash your creativity. So they feeling creative right now. Of the sexual arts. This is like twin flame. They want to get creative with you. That's crazy because the last reading I just did was talking about sexual pleasure and stuff like that. Um, they they like your creativity when it comes to the sexual arts. It's, it's, it's like an art. This is, you know, this is not just wham, bam, thank you, ma'am with y'all, okay? This is way more than that. And they're feeling like they have faith in this connection, okay? Master number 33, master number 22, and number 31 with number 16, okay? Pay attention to the signs and inner child. They're healing their inner child. They want you to know that um, they have faith in this connection. They have faith in you. Um, they want you to have faith in them. Yeah, because they feel like it's a hole in their soul, like a void in their soul without you. They love you. They feel like you're very beautiful. They're now finally discovering their purpose. They feel like you are a part of their purpose and they have a hole in their soul without you. They're trying to heal their inner child. They have been paying attention to the signs that the divine has been giving them. They want sex with you. They want to explore different sexual ways with you, the sexual art. It's an experience with you guys. It's like experiencing the sun and the moon and the stars when you guys end up having sex, if you haven't already. Yeah, they ready. Y'all, what, what's that song by Cisco? Unleash the dragon. Y'all really want me to unleash the... I, I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but um, they want to unleash their sexual creativity on you. And they want to show you the real them because this man is like naked. Um, they look up to you. They want to embrace this connection. They're trusting in the divine about this. And they're doing the work. They've gotten the signs that they need to heal their inner child and they've been doing it. It may have taken a little longer than you expected, but it's happening. What else you want to tell them, Miss Love call. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you, letting you know. So they want to they want to reach out to you. They want to express to you how much they love you. This could be a call. This could be through text or something. You have been mirroring to them. Look, mirror, mirroring each other, self-image, relationship, reflect their wounds, introspection. So they've been had, they've been um, recognizing that you guys are mirror souls, that you guys do mirror each other. And this time it's in a good way. You're mirroring the positive things to each other. Usually, you know, in the beginning of the connection, that's also how you know that this the separation phase is coming to an end. Because usually in the beginning, you mirror to each other the things that make you the most insecure and the most doubtful and feeling worthless. Those things are being mirrored so that it can be healed. And now that you've been healing, you're now mirroring to each other the upside of things. You get what I'm saying? And they're like ready to connect with you in different ways. So even if they come at you in a sexual way, it's because that may be their love language. We got engagement ring. Engagement, partnership, commitment, eternity, union, completion. They want union with you. They feel like you complete them. They're ready to open up and express this to you. That, that you've been mirroring to them how to heal themselves and how to love and how to work on their inner child. They be watching you. They look at your photographs. They missing you. They want to make new memories with you. They think about the old memories with you. This is Six of Cups energy. This is reunion energy. They want this relationship to ascend to a higher level of commitment. You guys will be talking soon. If you're not talking now, you will be having solid communication more. More communication. Um, interested in conversing. Awaited messages. Arrived text, call, email, hovering. We also got Cupid's Arrow and Coffee Cup. They want to meet up. They changed a lot with the butterfly. But Cupid's Arrow, have faith. Look, have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting. 
okay? They may be hesitating a little bit because they're still a little fearful and doubtful, but they're needing to trust spirit and trust themselves. And that's their inner child, the scared version of them, the young version of them that may be scared that may have been rejected before. Um, they're a little scared, but they want to meet up with you. Um, Cupid's arrow has struck them, all right? Have faith that this is happening. This is somebody who want to marry you. Like they could have a whole engagement ring or something. If that's what you've been manifesting and that's what you've been attracting, then that's what's here for you. Um, it will start with communication, some solid communication. They want to see, see you face to face. They're finally taking the time to look in the mirror. What we got for love for? King of Wands for Love Call with the Ace of Swords. The King of Wands is ready to take the initiative to express something to you. So you could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or you could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But they want to bring some type of truth to you. They're seeing things from a higher perspective. This person is feeling very passionate about you and they want to clear the air, okay? They want to make things clear when it comes to this connection. Okay, I feel like they could could have felt trapped or stuck or all up in their head, self-sabotaging this connection for a while. But I feel like they're trying to get out of that energy um, of feeling trapped or stuck or um, just overthinking, overactive mind, um, just self-sabotaging, pushing things away that, you know, just not seeing clearly, being confused. Oh, we got some mirror. Clarify mirror. Hmm. Okay. Page of Cups with the Six of Cups. I, I literally just said this was Six of Cups energy. They want to return to you. They have an offer of love to you. They want to express to you. They love you just as much as you love them. Y'all inner childs are free to be together. Um, excuse the noise that's the washing machine but um, y'all inner child are free together they really in love with you they want to express it to you they may have an apology there um, they have been healing old wounds they have been healing their wounds and stuff like that they may be apologetic for wounding you um, not recognizing that certain things that they were doing wasn't um, was hurtful could have put you in a third party situation um it's different for each of you but um this person is looking at you like the person that they want to celebrate with we do got engagement ring and then we got um the three of cups with the four of cups in the reverse so if this person rejected you in the past they no longer wants to reject this they no longer wants to miss this opportunity this was a missed opportunity due to a third party situation and now they want to fix this um they feel like they they want to propose to you. You're the person that they want. They want to rush in towards you, rush in to connect with you. They look at your photos. They think about you all day. They miss the love that you shared with them. You have this unconditional, limitless love, okay? It's very selfless, and they miss that about you. It's very beautiful, but it's very strong at the same time. Like, you have this energy about you. You're very much connected to spirit. Um, you're connected to nature. You are um, in control of your emotions, okay? You are someone very beautiful, and they want to rush towards that. They want to rush into this because I feel like they feel the same way that you that you do. They feel just as much love. They no longer want to miss this opportunity. They do look at this as a missed opportunity, and they, does, they don't want to miss this opportunity anymore. They want to celebrate with you. They want to do life with you. So they come in towards you. This is communication that's going under talking with the page of wands. They're going to initiate communication towards you. Yeah, they're going to initiate communication. It could be coming in very quickly. Um, you may get some type of communication from them. All right, because they're now feeling more balanced about this connection. They're, they're feeling more balanced where they can express themselves freely, um, you know, truthfully. 
um, honestly and want to express their love because the Queen of Cups definitely expresses her love and the King of Cups definitely gets his goals and gets things done and they want to bring some type of truth. They want to reconcile. This is a reunion energy. Um, you'll be celebrating soon. They want to propose to you. They want to express everything to you. They want to open up. They want to love on you. The more that they've been healing themselves and the more that you've been healing themselves, the more that you've been healing yourself, the more that they've been heal healing themselves because you've been mirroring to them how to heal themselves. Oh, yeah. Ten of Pentacles. They view you as their forever. Have faith. Love is coming. Surprise invitation or meeting. Okay. This could be a windfall of money. This is generational wealth that you guys will build for your family. This is legacy money. This is you having the house, the car, the, the crib, the kids, the marriage. Remember, it's not about the wedding. It's about the marriage, okay? So I feel like you you guys will have this beautiful marriage. This is something that's worth waiting for. This is something that you invested a lot of energy and time towards manifesting. And now it's ready to come into fruition. It may took a long time to get there, but it's here now. It's overall energy. Look, the tower. It's about to happen for you suddenly. This happens suddenly. Some, someone comes in out of nowhere, okay? They're feeling a little stressed and worried, but they know that they need to rush in towards you because you fulfill their wishes. You're their, you're their person, and they want to protect you, Empress. They want to protect their divine Empress, okay? And they want to bring balance into the situation. They also want to get you pregnant, all right? Because we got sexual arts and unleash your creativity. They're going to unleash some creativity for your butt, okay? So be ready to become a little bit more flexible, right? <laughs> so say a prayer for yourself and your person. Be kind and gentle to yourself and your person. Namaste.